moving to the desert isn't for the faint of heart. If you're new to Phoenix and haven't been through a summer, here are some things you should know. Temperature-wise, this has been a mild June. We're typically baking brownies on our dashboards by Father's Day. So if this is your first summer in Arizona, buckle up, buttercup, because Mother Nature is still preheating the oven. Consider investing in a great sunshade for your vehicle. If you're parked in the sun, the interior temperature of your vehicle can easily surpass 120 degrees in summer, and those metal buckles heat up real fast. I encourage you to check out the custom windshield covers at Covercraft.com. They're specific to your make and model, so they perfectly fit and are a lot more durable than the twist and fold types found in most stores. Since it's dry in Arizona and we don't perspire as much, it's pretty easy not to notice how much water our bodies lose throughout the day. To avoid headaches, muscle aches, and excessively dry skin, it's a good idea to keep a bottle of water with you and stay hydrated throughout the day. Avid hikers are especially at risk for dehydration and overheating. So if you're new to the valley, plan your hikes and outdoor activities in the early morning before temperatures get into the triple digits. Hikers often have to be helicoptered off the mountain due to dehydration or overheating each summer. Don't let that happen to you. On the topic of water, grass in Phoenix only needs to be watered once every three days. It may sound crazy, but grass here actually thrives in summer when it gets a deep soak every three days. Watering your grass every day makes your grass delicate and prone to heat stress and will also unnecessarily increase your water bill. The best way to water your grass is with a few intervals in the early morning before the sun comes up to reduce evaporation. And lastly, as temperatures rise, so will your electrical cooling costs. Homes with poor insulation, inefficient or leaking ductwork, or gaps at doors and windows often cause their HVAC systems to work harder than needed. Consider investing in a home energy checkup with APS or SRP. A specially certified contractor will come to your home to identify energy efficiency improvements and could save you a significant amount of money this summer. For more tips on living in Phoenix, be sure to follow and comment below.